The Boxer Remotely Controlled Howitzer, or RCH-155, is a self-propelled artillery system, which utilizes 8x8 chassis of Boxer Armored Personnel Carrier and 155mm Artillery Gun Module AGM. This artillery system was developed by Cross Maffei Wegman as a private venture. It was introduced in 2014. Initial firing trials took place during the same year. Overall the Boxer RCH-155 is a modern and advanced artillery system. It is being proposed for various customers. In 2022 Germany approved the sale of 18 units to Ukraine. First units are planned to be delivered in 2025. The artillery gun module was first introduced back in 2004. It is based on the technology of a combat-proven PZH-2000 self-propelled howitzer, which is in service with Germany and some other countries. The AGM provides the same performance of the PZH-2000, but is cheaper to build, has reduced crew and is significantly lighter. It was developed as a supplement to the PZH-2000 howitzer where heavier weaponry is not available, not recommendable, or too expensive. The Boxer RCH-155 is operated by a crew of just two men. This artillery system is highly automated. It has fully automatic loading system, which loads both projectiles and charges. So the artillery module is completely unmanned. This artillery system is armed with a 155mm L52 howitzer. Gun components are from the PZH-2000 howitzer. The Boxer RCH-155 also retains performance of the PZH-2000. It has a rate of fire of 6 to 8 rounds per minute. It is also capable of multiple rounds simultaneous impact firing. This artillery system is compatible with all standard NATO 155mm projectiles. Tiles. Maximum range of fire is 30 km with standard projectile, 40 km with base bleed projectile and 56 km with South African VLAP rocket-assisted projectile. A total of 30 rounds of ammunition and are carried for the main gun. A lifting system is installed at the front of the turret. It allows the crew to reload magazine from outside of the vehicle. Essentially this artillery system can be adapted for a lighter gun such as a shorter 155mm L39 or even 105mm gun. The Boxer RCH-155 has an advanced fire control system. It receives target data via radio or data link. The gun is automatically laid using the fire control data. This howitzer is aimed and fired by the crew remotely from the cab. Though in case of emergency or failure this artillery system can be loaded and fired manually. It takes approximately 30 seconds to open fire. Out of action time is also as short as 30 seconds. After firing the last round vehicle can leave its position in order to avoid counter-battery fire. Demonstrator of this artillery system carries no defensive weapons, such as machine guns or automatic grenade launchers. However production variant might be fitted with secondary armament. Vehicle hull has a modular hull armor with special ceramic mix. The triple hull floor is shaped for maximum protection against anti-tank mines and improvised explosive devices. It is claimed that front arc withstand hits from 30mm projectiles. All-round protection is against 12.7mm rounds. Damaged armor slabs can be easily replaced in field condition. The turret is made of lightweight aluminum armor and provides protection only against small arms fire and artillery shell splinters. Vehicle is fitted with NBC protection system for the crew. Also this artillery system has low radar and acoustic signatures, making it harder to detect. The Boxer RCH-155 is powered by a more powerful engine than the standard Boxer armored personnel carrier. It is fitted with an MTU 199TE20 turbocharged diesel engine, developing 804 horsepower opposed to 711 horsepower on the original armored personnel carrier. Its chassis uses a number of proven and commercially available automotive components. Vehicle is fitted with a central tire inflation system, which improves mobility over difficult terrain, such as sand, snow, and mud. Overall the Boxer has outstanding mobility and cross-country performance. This artillery system can easily redeploy from one location to another. Vehicle is fitted with auxiliary power unit, which powers all necessary systems when the main engine is shut down.